believe I missed it. Whoa, that is Chad? Oh my gosh, what happened? I just got in a huge fight over at the falls. They don't like you either. Funny, we were shooting a scene. No, it's hard to believe I could look this good when I look this bad, huh? Normally that would have charmed you. What's up with you? Nothing. I'm just a little bummed. I missed my prom back home, and I just got some pictures from my best friend. Oh, you're not missing much. I've been to a bunch of proms, and they've all ended in disaster. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, episode 10, my hair caught on fire. Last year's season finale, my date turned out to be my long-lost sister. What? Uh, Chad, those are fake proms. Fake proms? Real proms? They all stink. No, they don't. They're romantic. You know, a girl dreams her whole life about going to prom and having that perfect dance with a very special guy. Then he gets hit on the head by a faulty disco ball, episode 16. You know what, Chad? You wouldn't know a real romance if it punched you in the face. In fact, you would know a real punch in the face if it punched you in the face. Is there something real about you? Well, here's something real for you. I really don't want to stand here and talk to you. Good, because I really don't want to stand here and talk to you. Good. 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 Hello? Good. <laughs> The races, I'm going places, might be a long shot, not gonna waste it. This is the big break, and it's calling my name. Gosh, you don't know that. You've never been to a prom. I've been working since my first diaper commercial. I'm 11. I was on the road doing my one-man show. Nico. Well, we're going to change all that, because I'm thinking we can have our own prom. You mean a prom sketch? No, like a real prom with dancing and twinkly lights and a really cool theme. Girls. That's not a theme, Nico. I know. I was just thinking about girls. And I'm thinking we have a really cool theme, you know, something fantastic, something magical, something we've all dreamed about. Tony Town! <laughs> what? It's a great dream and a heck of a town. I was thinking about something a little more romantic, like a night in the clouds. You know what? I'm on board, and I'll do music. Wicked, wicked, wicked! Foo, foo, dude. <laughs> if you do music, you won't be able to dance with the cute girls. I don't know how to dance. Well, it's time you enrolled at the Nico School of Dance. Well, I just promised her to do music. First lesson's free. Sonny, first lesson's free. Fine, go ahead. I'll do the wicker, 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 wicker. Okay. <laughs> okay, who's gonna do food? <clears throat> okay, fine, I'll do food. Invites? Oh. Oh, thank you, Nico. Oh, I actually, I was going to suggest you do that, too. You know what? I'm happy to do everything because I want this prom to be perfect. Then I accept. What? I will be your prom queen, and I'll stop begging. Uh, question. Are we bringing dates to this shindig? Because I just broke up with my boyfriend, Holloway. No, but you had a boyfriend named Holloway? <laughs> yeah. That's the last time I'll get involved with a ten-year-old. <laughs> in fact, why don't you put me in charge of security? Holloway ruined romance for you. Nah, I just like wearing black. <laughs> well, why don't we make this a no-date prom? And we'll invite kids from the other TV shows on the lot. Who's with me? Ooh, I am. Well, as long as you're doing everything, why not? <laughs> the spirit. <laughs> Hello? Good. Make a left. Now proceed south for point zero six miles. Uh, is this a bad time? Stupid new GPS. I can't figure out how it works. I've been trying to get to the bathroom for the last 30 minutes. It's down the hall, where it's always been. I know that, and you know that, but she doesn't know that. What can I do for you? Marshall, I just wanted to let you know that we're going to have a prom. Thanks for the heads up. Mm -hmm. Now. What? Oh, 
I know. I forgot to say the magic word. <laughs> Please, may I? No. <laughs> Maybe if you knew the theme. What is it? A night in the clouds. Oh, that's nice. No. <laughs> What do you have against proms? Sweetheart, look, I have nothing against proms, but if I let you have a prom, I have to give in to everybody. Nico gets his carnival, and Grady gets his puppet show. We'll all be living in Tawny Town. Is that what you want? Do you want to be living in Tawny Town? I hear it's a heck of a town. I'll take that as a no. Very light on your feet, my dear. Whew. I think we made quite a couple. <laughs> First lesson's going well. Yeah. Now dip. Woo! Oh. <laughs> That's not actually gonna happen, is it? Everybody laughed when I bought this. Who's laughing now? I'm not. That's my toothbrush. <laughs> You know, Sonny has some crazy ideas, but having a prom may be the best thing that's ever happened to us. <laughs> Plums off, everybody. What? I've been dreaming about being prom queen ever since you brought it up 18 minutes ago. I'm sorry. I tried. I even used the magic word. This is like the puppet show all over again. Guys, nobody's more disappointed than I am. You had to ask Marshall. Always got to do everything by the book. Oh, yeah? Is that what you think? Is that what you all think? Yeah. What you think is what you do. Well, I just checked out a new book. And it's called, We're Having a Secret Prom by Sunny Monroe. Oh, are you suggesting that? That's right. A secret prom. A secret prom? A secret prom? A secret prom? A secret... Okay, I think we've said it enough times. <laughs> We're having a secret prom. Yeah. How come you got to say it again? Because I wrote the book. I thought you checked out the book. Oh, wait. I'm confused. <laughs> Okay, there's no book, but we're having a prom. Wait, wait, a secret prom? Yes, are we all on the same page? Whoa, wait, there's a page? <laughs> really? Please continue to hold it while I recalculate your route. For heaven's sakes, lady, will you just let me pee? It's this way. <laughs> okay, come on, everybody. We've got a secret prom to set up. Hey, Chad, sorry, I can't talk, I'm in a hurry. Oh, right, right, that's secret prom. You know, not much of a secret when every kid in the lot's walking around with flyers that read, secret prom. Aren't you excited? I'm so excited. I'm even excited about how excited I am. Yeah, we're not really feeling that over at the falls, mostly. We just think it's dumb. Well, if you think it's so dumb, then maybe you and your little snobby friends at McKenzie Falls shouldn't come. Well, maybe we won't. Good, because you're officially uninvited. Good, because we officially wouldn't have come anyway. You're only saying that because I just uninvited you. You're only uninviting me because I just said I didn't want to come. Are we done here? Oh, we're beyond done. Good. 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 So we're good? Oh, we're so good. <laughs> I'd say we clean up pretty nice. <sighs> Why, sir, you look smashing. As do you, sir, as do you. <laughs> Oh, Tawny, you look really cute. Hold that obvious thought. Okay, you are now free to ooh and ah. Whoa. Also acceptable. That wasn't your whoa. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> really? <laughs> okay, one more. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh, look at us, we all look so promy. Attention, promers! Marshall has left the building! Come on, let's make dreams happen, people! Go, 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 go! Hey, Sunny, you're not suddenly interested in being prom queen, right? No. Okay, then. You look really pretty. <laughs> oh, look at me, turtling my way to prom. <laughs> I can't believe this is really happening. <sighs> Marshall, you're not supposed to be here! You're in a fancy dress. Twirling. At seven o'clock at night. Mm-hmm. My office. Look at me, twirling my way into trouble. <laughs> it's 
So you're here late, you're all dressed up. And I'm thinking all signs point to one thing. Marshall, I can explain. You're doing a prom sketch. <laughs> huh? Yeah, but you already <laughs> explained it for me. <laughs> <See>? <laughs> all right. Prom sketch, I like it. All right, we'll have a little brainstorm. Let me just put on my comedy thinking cap here. All right, what have you got so far? Imagine this. <laughs> There's this girl, and she's dressed like me. <laughs> And she's late for the prom. The prom she has waited her whole life for. But she's drove a little too much, and now she's in trouble. Is this sketch going to get funny soon? Because it actually sounds kind of sad. Yeah, trust me, I'm working on it. <laughs> Check it out, Brady. It's the Lunchbox Girls from our favorite game show, Meal or No Meal. What do you think they have in there? Uh, I'm guessing number five has a banana, 12 has yogurt, and number seven has one million dollars. Red alert, red alert! Marshall's back and Sonny's stuck in his what? office. What? I thought it was your job to keep an eye on me. It was, but he's like a jungle cat. <laughs> oh, okay, I've, I've got an idea that'll get him off the lot. You get him off the lot, and I'll keep him off the lot. Okay. So the prom's going on, and this poor girl is still stuck in the office. You know? <laughs> she can hear the thump, thump, thump of the music. Thump, 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 thump. <laughs> yeah, and just when the girl thought it couldn't get any worse, it did. <laughs> I love it. Well, the more miserable she is, the better. <laughs> you know what we need now? A twist. Hello? Marshall Pike. This is Chip Dipper from K-Hug Radio. Congratulations, you've won a valuable prize. I won a valuable prize. All you have to do is get in your car with your GPS right now and come down to the station to claim your valuable prize. What's my valuable prize? Yeah, who cares? It's valuable. Go get it. I'll believe it right now. Oh, boy. I've only had this for a day. It's already paying for itself. <laughs> Finally, the part where the girl gets to go to her prom. <laughs> Hey, number seven is smiling at you. She's the million dollar girl. Mm -hmm. Okay, remember all them dance moves I taught you? Mm -hmm. Compliment, hip, and twirl. Mm -hmm. That's my boy. Let's go. <laughs> Hello, ladies. So, uh. Ooh, you must be the tween gladiator hunks, or should I say twunks? <laughs> I'm Tawny. I'll be your prom queen for the evening. And as your prom queen, I'd just like to say. <laughs> You pigs! You ate all our food! Oh my gosh, Tawny, you will not believe what just happened to me. Marshall just caught me and I got stuck in his you office. got problems? We need more food. Already? But the prom just started. I know. Those gladiators are animals. I can't wait to get back in there. Get back? But I haven't even been in there once. Oh, it's fabulous. I mean, you've really outdone yourself. Don't forget the mustard. <laughs> fall off. Mm -hmm. That's because she's in the arms of the captain. Well, the captain is about to take her out into open water. No, no, no. Oh, 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 oh. It's in a blanket coming through. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, I really hope the five-second rule applies here. <laughs> hey, I have three more seconds. Chad? What are you doing here? You were invited. Well, I was invited, but I didn't want to go. Then I was uninvited, so I knew I had to go. No, no, no. You're not going to my prom before I do. And these are for invited guests. So you're saying I can't have one? Yeah, you heard me. Well, then I have to have one. <laughs> hey! Mmm. Mm. This tastes good. You know where it would taste better? It's for your prom. <laughs> hey, check it back here. Thanks for giving me another chance. I think I got it now.
I forgot. What was I saying? Oh, yeah, night to remember. Oh, man, I can't go like this. Okay, address has been entered. Take me to my valuable prize. GPS activated. <laughs> Welcome. Is your seatbelt passing? Yes. Are you sure? Who are you, my mother? Please proceed 0.8 miles and make a right, then a left, then a right, then two more lefts, then a left and a right, and a left and a right, and a left and a right, and a left and a right. I was born for power. There's got to be another dress in here somewhere. dressed like a queen you're trying to steal my crown this is what you've been waiting your whole life for this is why you moved here from wisconsin but tony my dress was covered in food i had to find something else to wear it was either this or the mermaid outfit <laughs> and what do you want me to do <sighs> happy now <laughs> yeah That's my fourth right. I've made a complete circle. Technically, you made a square. <laughs> hey, Zora, have you, uh... Zora? Marshall? Chip Tipper. No, it's Nico. Nico, what are you doing on my GPS? You kids are up to something. I'm coming right back. That was probably the wrong thing to say. <laughs> That's right, number five, mermaids going to prom. <laughs> Finally. Sonny, we got a big problem. Really? Is it worse than this? Hey, it's about equal. Marshall's coming. I just need to see my prom for one second. Wow. This is fantastic. This is everything I could have ever dreamed of. Turn on down! Enters. Sunny, perfect timing. Oh, hey, Marshall. Wait a minute. You all sent me on a wild goose chase and had me drive around in the shape of a square just so you could rehearse your prom sketch? Sure, let's go with that. You know what? You kids work too hard. Listen, forget the prom sketch. Have yourselves a real prom. Hey, you could do it in here. You've got to be kidding me. I call prom queen. <laughs> For what it's worth, you threw a cool prom, Sonny? <laughs> yeah, sorry you didn't get to enjoy any of it, but thanks. <laughs> hey, so you finally made it. Chad, what are you still doing here? I thought you'd be the first to go. Which is exactly why I had to be the last to go. <laughs> well, Chad, you were right. All problems end in disaster. Do they, Sonny? Do they really? Because sometimes, I heard, you get to have that perfect dance with that one special person. You're just gonna have to settle for me. <laughs> this is sweet. <clears throat> I have my moments. You gonna press play? Oh, right. Sorry.
There's a bathroom here somewhere. 